Hello everyone, this is Blue Thunder Fan Racing, and welcome back to Let's Play The Legend of Zelda Link to the Past. In the last episode, we we upgraded some stuff, and in this episode we're going to be moving towards the red pendant on our map. The location of the red pendant, and I know just where to go. So as we're continuing on here... I can't stress enough about the laptop stuff. I do ap apologize if there is, if there's a drop in quality, but I, I I literally can't do anything about it. Ah, you tried to run away. You suck. Life. Maybe there's actually something else I can get here. So I'm not gonna want to get that. Yeah, but you see here, there's a rock here, we can pick this up. Uh, there's this guy. Oh, by the way, if you touch him, Link will do his what-the-fuck face, but it won't take any damage. So, well. <laughs> and here, we got two guys of creepy faces. Maybe it's nothing, but this tree feels kind of strange as we cut it. Yo, Rink, a mysterious fog re has recently fallen over the forest. We have to be careful. Yeah, think about- you're gonna have to think about this tree later. Uh, I think there might be something behind here. Uh, no, this is for- You can see a heart piece there, but we can't get that right now. You're gonna have to think about it- wait, you're gonna have to wait for it later. There's gonna be something- there's gonna be a thing that happens. Not gonna say any more about it. Uh, I don't think there's anything here. All right, it's time. Let's go. Let's go ahead and move towards the mountain on the map. Pick it up! I'm gonna be a macho man. And we'll go into the cave. And we're gonna make our way towards the cave, and you can see there's no way back. We're not coming back. Not na not right now at least. Not for not for a while at least. So, so as we make our way through, we've we got an old man. I don't know who you are, but if you're going to go up the mountain, will you take me with you? I lost my lamp, so so we're gonna take him with us, I guess. Look out for the holes. Uh, watch your step. There are holes in the ground. Could you turn? Could you turn right here? I mean, are you going? Are you also going to the mountain to look for the golden power? Just ahead is a mountain full of monsters. Many people have vanished in this mountain while looking for the golden power. I don't want to see you wrong, so please don't get too involved in such a mad quest. Oh, we'll see if it's mad. <laughs> hmm. That's interesting. And we're out. And say hello to Death Mountain, the Mountain of Doom. Get ready for rocks. Oh my god, rocks. The missing mains are still alive somewhere. I believe the hero will rescue them. I wait for that day. I wait for that day. Uh, these are dangerous times. I talked too much. Anyway, thank you for your kindness to an old man like me. Uh, I wanted to give you this. If you're wondering if a magical transporter, gaze into this mirror. Do -do -do -do! It's a mirror! <laughs> he gave you the magic mirror. The mirror is blue, clear, and beautiful. You feel like it's going to absorb you into another world. And... Ah! Well then. <laughs> this guy will restore our health. And there's a cave in here. I believe we're supposed to go into this cave. I don't remember. Um... All right.
You can't get, you can't kill this guy right away. <laughs> well, now we're gonna go out here, and we're, we're moving up. And more rocks. Well, well, I sure do hope that these rocks don't rock my world. <laughs> Ow. <laughs> Alright, and now if we get up here, the rocks will stop falling. Fantastico. And there's a heart piece there. Um, yeah, okay. We're going to here. This place is called Spectacle Rock. I guess it's shaped like eyes or something. I guess it's shaped like spectacles or something. And I can see a heart piece there, but we can't go there now. I'm going to fall down this hole, though. Yeah. You definitely want to keep this place in line later if you want if you want to get all the heart pieces. I mean, I don't want to get all. I don't need to get all of them, but I want a lot of them. So, keep that in mind as you're exploring Spectacle Rock. Also, I need to go back up, actually. Ah, crap. Um, I screwed up. Alright, so we're gonna have to fall down here, and hopefully we don't get rocked. Alright. Ow! That should've been perfect. Alright. So, uh, we got ourselves this... Ooh, this weird ma this magical transporter. Well, that's what I think it is. I don't know. It's a magic. It's it's a magical warp tile. You'd think it'll transport you into a thing, but eh, it's probably not. It's probably nothing. But eh, I might as well stand on it. Well, yeah, let's go, let's go for it. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> you can see we've turned into a fucking buddy! <laughs> and you see we can't do anything! And the map, and if you go to the map, it's colored differently. The map's a little different, so. Where could we be? This, is a, this isn't normal. So, yes, Link has turned into a bunny. And I'm going, I'm going to explore the place. I don't think there's really anything important, but, I don't know, it's worth a look. Oh, uh, this, this cave. Yeah, we're going to be coming back here. Yeah, actually, never mind. I like the music, though. Lots of nostalgia of this song. Yes, I find it's completely bizarre how Link turns into a pink bunny. Pink bunny rabbit. Why did they... They never brought this back. This is like... Why, this is like... Bizarre. Yeah. And we have a weird... Ogre... Rhinox thing... Kicking around a... Pink ball with... Happy eyes. It's bouncing everywhere and making weird sounds. And it looks panicky. Uh, hi there, Mr. Rhinox guy. What do you want? Do you have something to say to me, silly rabbit? I came here to get the gold, the power of gold, but now I'm a freak and I can't go back to the real world. If only I had the moon pearl from the Tower of Hera, I could go back to my original shape. I've got, go I've got good reason to be stressed out. So back off! Shoot! Shoot! And here's the ball. <laughs> oh, who are you, Mr. Bunny? This world is like the real world, but evil has twisted it. The golden power is what changed your shape to reflect what is in your heart and mind. Wait, so Link, Link thinks about Link thinks about bunnies. <laughs> Link, Link, Link's life is bunnies because he turned into a pink bunny. Anyway, I am always changing my mind, so I turned into a ball. But if you have a a ball called the Moon Pearl, you can keep your original shape here. Interesting. You're talking about something called the Moon Pearl. And how it can make you not, not a, a bunny. 
anyway, uh, can you please not kick that in the center? Oh, wait, never mind. Basically, um, yeah. Remember what the old man said about the about that this mirror? Basically, you want to go to this spot, and, and, uh, you're going to use the magic mirror. Oh, oops. Uh, hold on. Here we go. Now, uh, use the mirror. And look where it puts us. It puts us on top of Spectacle Rock. Here we got a heart piece. And we're over to the other side. So yeah, that's fantastic. By the way, I hate these guys. Yeah. Uh, I believe we can actually do something right now. Yeah, uh, book, bring the Book of Medora here and use it. And yeah, hold the Master Sword and you'll get the Magic of Ether. Interesting. So we're going to need the Master Sword for this, but once we get the Master Sword, we can get some kind of magic called Ether. But as we're... Oh, screw you. But here, you got the... That's the Tower of Hera. We're gonna be... We're gonna be going there. We're gonna be going there real quick, but I'm gonna, just gonna explore the place. Up, oh, Tektites! Yep. You can't hit me. Give me space. He's mad. He's like, <laughs> all right. Now that I'm done being weird, I think that we're going we're gonna be heading into the Tower of Hera in this episode because I've recorded for about 12 minutes and that's not enough. So we're going to start the Tower of Hera in this episode. Here is the dark and foreboding music. Now you see we got these switches here. Uh, you want to you, these balls. You want to whack them with your sword, and they're switches, so they'll open these places up. And uh, you don't want to go up here. You're, you're going to want to go down here. Well, you're going to. Oh. Rink. It is I, Sahasho, <laughs> the Elder. I have some advice in the dungeon. You get the weird. You can gaze at a magic mirror to return to the entrance at any time, don't forget this. Screw you. And also, um, we got those things, we're gonna go up here and open this chest. And we got a map. There we go, we killed that. Okay, and we need a key to go down here, so what do we do? Well, this is, this is the only place that we can go, so why don't we go down here? And, uh, get ready for terribleness. Oh, this is- oh, this isn't what I think it is. Well, the terribleness is coming. Alright, whack this switch. Uh, don't do that. There we go, destroy the Moldorm, and we get a key! Now we can go down any other- go down th that other- we can go to the other spot, and- wait, we're locked. Uh, we can, use, we can use the boomerang to knock them, to, to hit the switch from a distance. And now we can use the key. And now, get ready for terribleness. This is the most annoying part in the game for me. This is, this is annoying. This is the definition of annoying right here. The floor tiles. You just sit in the... It's best to sit in the corner and mash away. And maybe you won't die. Ow. Ah, crap. Come on, come on. Don't murder me. Don't murder me, silly sexy tiles. Oh, jeez. <laughs> I'm alive with, like, one heart. Yay. I... Come on, get a life! <laughs> Oh no! And yeah, we got mold orms. If I get hit, I'm going. We might be seeing. I'm. In, um. Yeah, I might die here. Um. Game's not what. Game's not one give me any hearts. Uh, maybe there's a, maybe there's hearts under these pots. Um, please. Booby, please. Um. Uh, there's no hearts. 
Oh, thank you. Now, at least I won't die in one hit. Now, uh, we're gonna light these lamps with the lamp. With the lamp. Also, that beeping sound driving me insane. That's nostalgic. This is nostalgic in a bad way. And basically, this chest is gonna pop up, and we're gonna open this up. And we got the big key already! So, yeah, I'm dying. Because <laughs> that's not fun. Alright, however, I think I'm probably going to be starting up fresh. I think I'm going to be... Although I'm not going to... I don't think I'm going to have to worry about dying here, because... I think I'm going... I'm, I think I'm probably going to call off, call the episode here. Because... Because I'd rather do... I'd rather do... Oh, no. <laughs> Get out of here! Oh, thank you. <laughs> yeah, I, ha I forgot... I had to hit the floor tile there. The tile... That, I mean, the switch. Alright, there we go. Um, we're alive, but this beeping sounds driving me insane. And before I go literally mad, I'm I'm going to uh, call the episode here. So in the next episode of Let's Play of uh, Let's Play Legend of Zelda: Link to the Past, we're going to continue for the Tower of Hera. And um, I'm going mad. See you next time. <laughs> <laughs> Fine.